The trailer the first time I was young, yeah, I know. Everyone was so fucking hyped about that game. That that game, you know how people talk about games that were hyped? You remember you guys remember when Cyberpunk was come out? I don't think I don't think there's been a game more hyped than Skyrim was. Skyrim was probably the most hyped game I've no, I, in my lifetime. I don't remember a single one. I do not suicide. I don't know how far I've seen him. Hi. I can't move with you, I don't get good RNG on my left click there, he's not dead. The main difference between Master and Diamond, people in Masters are better at everything than people in Diamond. I played Skyrim and I could never get into it. Combat was too stale. Um, the game appeals to people in a way that games don't appeal to me. The Last of Us 2 is liberal propaganda. I mean, The Last of Us 2 is like one of those games that all the um, media loves it and all the actual players don't like it. So it wins awards even though like it's the actual players don't like the game. Go on in three, two, go on. So brave and stunning. Fuck who equals win, by the way. No, 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 Especially if I'm popping off. Is the game again argument again? Well, it's the same thing with a lot of things. It's, it's like like that new Dave Chappelle special, right? If you if you look at the reviews, it's like all the critic reviews are all like in the twenties and the thirties, and then the actual like like the pleb reviews are all in like the high nineties. Sure, some of that is like political. No question, some of that's political, but smartest soldier player, by the way. I fucking wish I had an ult. I fucking wish my hero was close to viable. We find the rest of trash. I mean, you don't play Last of Us for the gameplay though. You play it for the story. So if the story is bad, then the game's bad. It's like imagine playing that fucking what's that? What was that game called? Death Stranding. Like the gameplay of that game was clearly horrific. You play it for the story. Like a game like Path of Exile, bro. The story in Path of Exile, I've played Path of Exile for like nine years. I don't even know what the story is. Because you don't play the game for the story, and if you do, you're a fucking loser. And ratio. Let's yeah, try and gameplay because I quote literally. My Death Stranding was just a fucking awful game. Any any game that's based on like any basically single player game that's based off story is always garbage. Like if I want to play a single player story game, I just watch a movie instead. I have no idea what that gets you in. Do we nano? Why do we nano? Never die. I'll do. 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 i will do i will do i i i i I, I, I played Red Dead Redemption for, for a long time. Probably, probably like four or five hundred hours. Never even played the story once. Never beat the story once. I got past maybe the second mission of the story. Uh, never played it. I don't really play it. The way we play that game is fucking lit. I love just basically becoming a terrorist and then the whole server tries to hunt you down. Is he on my head? What the fuck is he?
Yeah. The best rocks one I played. I, I, know, I never played GTA. I never played GTA multiplayer. But Red Dead, Red Dead 1 multiplayer experience was unreal. Very, very, very few things have ever uh, come close. Saints Row 2 is really good as well. The problem with Saints Row 2 is that you couldn't play more than two people. Which, in my opinion, if you could have played Saints Row 2 multiplayer with like, with like, like you know, 32 people, that kind of like, like in a GTA start, it would be unfucking parallel good. It would be unparalleled good. good. Score. Run like shit. What? Well, um, Saints Row 2. Yeah, Saints Row 2 had tons of tons of situations. Prepare your defenses. Select your hero. There was a bug in uh, in Saints Row 2's uh, multiplayer. If you played for like an hour or two, you just get a bug where your sound would just stop, and all you would hear is the sound of like like a car going. And that was it. They couldn't hear anything else. Saints Row games, no point playing anything. Just fuck around. That's true. But but in my opinion, the game Saints Row 2 is the best game in the history of games if you just want to fuck around with your mates. Like I remember, we used to play me and my uh, me and my mate. We used to play called uh, it was called Kamikaze Wars, where you would have evil cars, low gravity, um, super explosions on, and then um, and then they they would you'd both start at the airport, and he and the person in, the person one person in a car, one person in a plane, the person in the car had to get to the top of the map before the person in the plane kamikaze and suicide bomb to kill the person in the car. Just shit like that was so fun. Because with super explosions and low gravity and evil cars, any explosion wipes the entire fucking planet off because it sets off a chain reaction of blowing up other cars. Fucking house. It's unreal. It was so much fun actually. Okay, what the fuck is going on with my mouse? It's good. Chai, get ready to clip and ship. The chips are cheating. You're still dead, bitch. Casual terrorism at a young age feels good, man. But bro, evil, evil cars. No, no. Stream. Okay, have a moment. I'm on wall. This is your devil is devil Evil cars in fucking in in Saints Row 2 is unreal. But every single fucking one, person member nine just tried to murder you. Two, one, go in. Like those were the days actually when games had oh, fucking go, 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 cheats. Go, 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 go. Do you remember when when games, like all games back in the day, used to type a little code in the fucking thing? And like it would get like a cheated version. That do that doesn't happen. Anymore. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Jesus Christ, this weed. I think Evil Cars was like thirteen or something. Or maybe that that was that was can't die. I still remember spider biking up the old tour building. That was one of my best achievements ever. There's a bug called spider biking where you, if you had your two, let's say I'm a motorbike, if you had your wheels and you went like that with your wheels on the wall, it would count as a four and you could drive up it. Two, one, go in. the way the, the, moment, the, like, the physics were working in that game. Doom for Sword is very powerful. Special move, honestly, one of the best in the games. Now here's okay. Look, here's the thing with Doom for Sword versus Tracer. I can get two kills there, but the reason I can't is because the fight's basically over anyway. But Tracer can get a double kill when they're losing the fight. That's the difference. Are you a weeb? Heck, I hecking love anime. Ladies and gentlemen, that's why you don't do the Illusio roll off. I'm dead. Knock, knock. <laughs> I have it on. Knock, knock. 
go in in three. Two, one. The next one. Hog, 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 on bite, hog, on bite. Hog, no hog. Break his arm, I used to play so many games on PS3 actually with my mates. Cause those are the days, bro. Those are the days. I wanted to scratch my competitive itch, I just play CS. Uh, I just play COD. Mod 2, man, and Black Ops 1. Man, bro, those games were something else. Most addictive game I've ever played by far was COD, was Mod 2. Oh, I'm good, Hook. Genji one, Genji one, Genji one. Yeah. I've never played a game more addictive than Modern Warfare 2. Never in my fucking life have I ever done that. That game was just like, especially when, especially when you're on the nuke grind as well. It's probably mostly scrubs probably weren't good enough to do. Nah, I'm gonna that either reason Genji. Um, it was fucking unreal, actually. Like, especially when you had a brother who was just as competitive as you. And you would you would race to see how many nukes you could get each. Maybe well, my first nuke was by camping, bro. bro. Bunch of in this maybe chat. maybe the most cringe thing in the history of people is people that complain about camping. Go, 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 go. Uh, like, why wouldn't you camp? Why would you not play the game effectively? Especially if you want to get if you want to get high kill streaks, literally can't get it um, by not camping. You have to camp to a degree because you're exposing yourself to like five angles rather than exposing yourself to one angle. Noob tube across the map. Hell yeah, I was noob tubing across the map. You fucking know it, bitch. Start start of the game. One man army noob tubes. You shoot your noob tubes across the map. Then you want my army to your real, to your real class, which is generally like uh, I prefer like the depends on the map. But if it's like a close range map, I like the Tar Twenty One Silence. If it was a long range map, I prefer like the ECR Silence. But you didn't camp with the noob tube because the noob tubes, one man army noob tubes weren't weren't particularly strong outside of the start of the round to get like two or three kills. Did that get melted or did you just not bubble me? How does that think? <laughs> Do we shit for anyone else right now? Um, I don't know. I was having lag issues searching. Okay. Good said you could split. No, just... Like, camping, here's the thing. Camping was really easy to beat. Like, it was really, really not hard to stop a camper. Just use nades and shit to get him out. Or use a sniper and camp. It's just a... Just a... What the fuck? Here the complaint like camping? We're just bad players. We didn't know how to beat a relatively easy strat. Like, all you had to do was bait out the claymore, which is really easy to do. Because if, if, if you knew how to peek claymores, which you should, you just bait the claymore, and then the guy has to worry about you flanking him because you have no claymores. And then, and then, you just need to snipe him. Like, the best way to play is just sniping. I was in sniping trick traps, yeah, same. Same. Especially towards the ends of mod 2, when I got to the point where, I, where getting nukes was just trivial. Meteor strike. Trick shot, 